Howdy y'all, I'm around the wheel. Once again, we return to the Cardboard Thunderdome, where one pack enters, and sometimes 15 cards leave, sometimes 12 cards leave, but today, 20 cards leave. That's right, today we have a Commander Legends booster, first ever draftable Commander set. I don't have a whole lot to say about it, other than I think it's a really fun one. Uh, I went half seas on a box with a buddy. Ended up getting most of the good mythics out of it, although he got Tevish, and I'm still a little raw about that. But, <laughs> but you know, maybe I'll have my own Tevish today. Who knows? We we have yet to get a super juicy hit out of Commander Legends. Oh man, the smell of that ink! Like I can smell it from all the way over here. <sighs> Commander Legends product just has a smell to it, you know. It's like that scene in Fast Times at Ridgemont High where they where they smell the test as soon as the teacher passes it out because they're getting a contact high off of the mimeograph fumes. I'm like the youngest person who knows what the thing I just said means. Anyway, we're starting off today here with a Haunted Cloak. Uh, wow, equipped creature has Vigilance, Trample, and Haste, and it equips for one. Huh, not bad for a... For a piece of equipment, it costs three to get it out there, but once it's out there, man, it, uh, it equips for cheap. That's not a bad little common to start with. We got our wild celebrants. When it enters the battlefield, you may destroy target artifact. Yeah, those those wild celebrations, they get a little crazy. You keep your artifacts away from the wild celebrants there. Can be blocked as long as defending player controls an artifact. Well... Let's, yeah, serpents are usually pretty expensive. Uh, got a molder beast here with, with old good old trample. A lot of artifact, a lot of artifact-based interaction here in these early cards. Commander Legends certainly has a few obvious chase cards. Uh, you know, jeweled lotus, mana drain, vampiric tutor, scroll rack, which I've gotten out of a pack already uh, before before now. Uh, Moss Diamond. We got a we got a little diamond cycle here of artifacts that enter tapped and add a color. This is the green one, obviously. Exquisite Huntmaster. All right, Seraph of Dawn. A uh, pretty simple little angel card there. Wow, this is actually kind of hurting my wrist a little. Maybe I should orient my wrist somewhat differently. Got a flying flying lifelink angel. Stone Fury. Feeling the Stone Fury. Deals damage to target creature equal to the number of lands you control. Oh, that's fun. All right. Ancient Animus. Put a plus one, plus one counter on target creature control. If it's legendary, then it fights target creature and opponent controls. That's cute. Got uh, some supernatural stamina. Kind of tilting my cards. Sorry. Tilting it away from the thing. It's a little hard to hold these up sometimes. Uh, Spectral Searchlight. That's a nice little... Choose a player... That player adds one mana of any color they choose. Nice little, nice little hug card there. That's fun. Maelstrom Colossus, a golem with cascade. Cascade always a lot of fun. Now we're on to the uncommons. Kanji's Lieutenant, uh, Bird Soldier, Sunset Pyramid enters the battlefield with three brick counters on it. You get some card draw out of it there for a little bit of mana payment. Confiscate, Enchant Permanent. You control Enchanted Permanent. And what is our rare going to be today? Let's see what we've got. A mythic... <laughs> yes! Yes! Oh! Ooh, finally a juicy hit on this channel. Oh my gosh, this is our first... This is our first big boy right here. Oh baby. Oh baby. Oh, oh. Mm. Let me just take this real quick. Give it a little kiss on the cheek. Mwah! Ooh, oh, baby. Oh, that's what you like to see right there. Oh, gosh. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, Uncle Roundy is a happy boy today. We haven't even gotten to the commander slots yet. In the commander slots, we've got Radiant Sarah Archangel. Not quite as radiant as a mana drain, but what could be? Let's see. Flying. Tap another untapped creature you control with flying. Radiant Sarah Archangel gains protection from the color of your choice till end of turn. She's a 6-4 angel, blah, 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 blah. Uh, we've got Captain Vargas Wrath. 
And there is a guaranteed foil back behind this. Not that you get too excited about foils in Commander Legends, because the foil quality on these cards in this set is just disastrous. Uh, famously called Pringles, but let's see what that con um, what that is. It's a fine Hornells. That's actually one of the more uh, that's actually one of the more desirable foils you can get. This is like a dollar fifty foil right here. I mean, it's not touching Mana Drain by a long shot. And we've got a woo. That is a that is a heck of a golem token. Look at that. But uh, I think we all know who the real star of the show is here. Let's let's bring it back for an encore. <laughs> Mmm, 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 mmm. Toasty. Time to sleeve that up. Stick it in the old... Stick it in the old mythic binder. And, uh... Mmm, well. That's certainly a nice little cherry on my day. I will see you guys next time. Oh, wow. It's gonna be a long time before we top that, I bet.